Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and today um, we're going to go over the cover stitch Pegasus W3500 series. Uh, this one happens to be the W3562P-01G. So um, uh, every machine has a model number and they have a spec number like this one. You see that one? 364. That means that it's three needle. The three means it's three needle. And six, 64 is 6.4 millimeter actually. Oh. That's the space between the first needle and the second needle. That would make it to a quarter inch. A mm -hmm. lot of people make a mistake. Six millimeter is not quarter. It's very, very close to quarter but the actual quarter inch is 6.4 millimeter. Mm -hmm. So the three means is three needle, six four means it's uh, 6.4. Um, now, uh, it's made by Pegasus. It's a flat bed cover stitch machine. Um, and when we say flat bed, it's a regular bed. It's not one of those cylinder bed. Mm -hmm. This is a submerged table, meaning sitting inside the table, it has a lower table, uh, with the door that swings forward and backwards. So you could actually use this for whatever you need to do. If you want to get rid of the top uh, doors, um, very easy to thread. Again, five thread. Every machine is included with a thread stand, LED lamp, table, leg motor, unless you guys don't want it. Um, cover stitch machine do not have bobbin or bobbin case or a hook. It has a looper. The way it works, it loops, loops thread. I'm gonna show you, like this is the top and this is the bottom. Now, this is really three needle, five thread. Uh, but you could also, as uh, you've seen it probably in my other videos, you could use this two needle and three thread. It's flatbed, very easy to um, thread. Oil goes in here, all the way. Machine comes with oil, the whole thing goes in there. This is the gauge that you could see how much oil you have in there and pumps up the oil. Um, tensions for five. Thread and I'm gonna go over some stuff that comes with the machine. So, again, you see this one? We call this an spreader on the top. This one right here. This is the one that I spread the top thread, the fifth thread. Mm -hmm. That's an spreader. You could also have a choice of not using this. Either you put the thread out or not just, you won't use it. Uh, this is the jersey, which is a t-shirt material that everybody uses, but I'm gonna use some on the polyester fabric. Uh, polyester is the fabric that they use on top of the tables. Tablecloth, mm. you see? Uh, I'm just gonna go over this. Whenever I try, usually, whenever we try the sewing machine, we gotta make sure you use different type of thread. So you know if there is a problem, which one has a problem, if you're trying it, not for sewing. And never take your thread out. You don't wanna take your thread out, all right? You wanna make sure that the thread are inside. Whenever you wanna change the color, cut them from here or even here. So you just put the thread and you just put them through. That's the whole idea. Now, Pegasus comes with a uh, CD. This is very good. Other, I never seen it in other company to do this. I mean, this is very good. I'm sure it said um, sewing machine. It doesn't tell me what is exactly inside, but I'm sure it's the, um, the manual or customer, you know. This is to open the needle set screw, which are right here on the bottom. This is tweezers. The system on the 
cover stitch and all the cover stitch are 128 GAS. U, Y, X, 128 GAS. And this is 10 and S means sharp. Mm. Okay. And you have ballpoint, you have sharp, you have universal. Usually uh, universal is the one that we use, but this is sharp. Uh, and a dust cover for the machine. Um, table, same normal table as every other table, 47 by 21. With K-legs, this is a brushless motor, uh, 550 watts, uh, speed up, speed down, speed up. These two you don't really touch because it's for different inputs. You don't need those, but uh, you might get a different type of motor, different type of uh, setting, but for now this is it. Okay, here we go. Sewing with Pegasus is very, very soft, you know? Soft. It's very, you know, look at the sewing. Pegasus is very popular for making machine for um, uh, jersey, light material, activers, uh, yoga wear. This is the machine that everybody buys. Now, it's again, I'm gonna go over it. And I, I've done this many, many times, but I'm gonna go over it. Again, you see these needles from, there's three needles here. You could use two or three. You could use either or, meaning you could do this combination, this combination, or this combination, mm. right? If you use this combination, it's one eight, both quarter, or this one, again, one eight. You could take the top thread out, which I'm not gonna take it out because this is going to a customer, okay? We have exact same one under new tech, 562. We sell the same exact sewing machine, 562. Ours is direct drive, meaning no external motor, Ours has the motor is right here. This one, the motor is outside. Okay? Um, things that you need to know about this machine. You could add, use many, many type of uh, folder, bias folder. I have one of them right here. This is the folder that goes right here. It's a bias folder. This is S124B. If you look in our website, it's a binding folder. You get a folder, this one. If you have a bias like this let's say this is a very thin um, bias but this is to fold bind this this way around your fabric so s124b stands for double fold meaning it will fold double clean finish and then we have the same thing on s124a that would fold only once you could, it's an option to buy an extra cover stitch fit for this machine to use with your folder. You see this tiny fit here? It's made, so when you have your, let me take this out, it makes it much easier. I think I have a, um, video on how to use one of these. So you see all these screws here, back and forth, is for setting up the folder, okay? This one, the string right here, is to put the bias in and out, so you get some tension. If you want more tension, you put through all of them. If you want less tension, you just put through one or two you could also get what we have, S290 is a bracket. We call it a bias bracket that goes to this side. It will hold your fabric right here. It's S290 and it's on our website. Okay, so you could just put your, your bias here and go through. And now, if you have your folder change, you might want to use one of these feet. You see this one? Goes right to the side. You see how nice it sits here? Okay. You know what, Lindsay? I forgot the nine number. 949094, I think it is. If you go to our website, you'll see. Now, you see here, if you close up, you see it says 6.4? Mm -hmm. This machine is 6.4, as we said. There are 
machines rarely in the market that people use. So whenever you buy a fit for your machine, uh, you gotta make sure it's 6.4, if your machine is 6.4. 6.4 means it's quarter inch between the gauge between the two needles, outside needles, oh, right. right? And now you wanna make sure that it's 6.4 millimeter, 5.6 is rare, it's very rare. Oh. I mean, everybody uses 6.4. Um, what else do I wanna tell you about this machine? That, oh. We also have a item called DU, DYU205. This is a hemming folder. Okay, this is the hemming folder that you have a, a video on this one. Two screws go here and you see this one, you open this one and you pretty much fold the fabric through and you sew it through. I'm gonna get a screwdriver and I'm gonna show you two that. It, it's amazing what it does. Why do that? I was there to get the screwdriver, so I'm gonna add seven inch between the needle and the neck, what we call here neck. And you don't need to know the height of this because it's really not necessary, but here is three inch to the top. This gap is about four and a half inch. And when you use your feet, you don't get more than quarter inch from here, okay? And you don't need more than quarter inch, right? It's very, very simple. Uh, legs are adjustable, the K legs are adjustable. And you see, you could open this up. I'm opening this up. And now, this is for people that are not buying this machine and buying different type of machine. If your machine, the bed of your machine doesn't have this screw holes, you could simply use any, um, uh, masking tape and just tape it to your machine so when this is done um, when you set this up imagine this is your fabric and you want to hem your fabric goes through here right and All that it goes through, right? And you could adjust it. So this is not a bias. Imagine this as a fabric, as a a, a, a piece of garment that you want to hem, not bias hem. Imagine this is a hem and you want to hem it, and that's how you do it. Uh, this is hemming folder again. D Y U two o five. Again, this machine is used with light material, but you could do very heavy material. The thread that we're using here is T27, polyester, fully polyester. If you come over, you could use woolly nylon thread. These are woolly nylon thread, T24, for a spandex. Again, a lot of people use them, and not necessarily we have them on our website. We're using this for a customer that is using uh, for an overlock machine, all right? So now on this denim jeans, you see this? These are, they call one way stretch. It's really stretchy. You could use this type of fabric on this type of thread on any stretchy stuff. People want to know if they use this thread on a stretchy fabric, yoga, when you pull it, will it, will it rip the thread? Will it break the thread? No, it will not. And let me just do some of this so you know that it also will work on a heavy material too. This is it. So see what I'm doing this right now? This will do the job for you. When you have it down here, uh, set, I'm being lazy today. Otherwise I would, I had to set it up and show you guys. But 
this one will do the job. This one will go and do the job of folding a uh, material for you. You wanna know how fast it goes? Yes. All of this word. Look. This is five thread, three needle. For a stretchy material, you see? Either way you do, you're not gonna have any problem. A great, great sewing machine for all different type of sewing. Again, uh, most people use this machine for yoga wear, active wear, um, jersey, dance wear, underwear. Um, this is flatbed again with 6.4 gauge, which is a quarter inch, complete set. This is going to one of our good customers. And we thought we we're gonna make a video on this. Again, everything is included, fully submerged. You don't need the tabletop. You don't need this machine to sit on top. You want it to sit down here. And um, again, overall, a great, great machine. This machine is one of my favorite. Pegasus is one of the favorites when it comes to light material. Been in market for a long time. And um, I think that's all she wrote. Anything else we have to cover? I think that's it. Beautiful. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please let me know what type of video you want me to do, what items, what uh, equipment, and I'll be more than happy to do it. Thank you so much for watching. watching.